Monster Energy NASCAR Cup Series Toyota Owners 400 is sponsored by Monster Energy, official sponsor of NASCAR. And by Toyota, let's go places. Let's go racing. It'll be 46 laps complete when they come around, and the green flag will be in the air. Kyle Busch, Kevin Harvick, row one. Logano and Kurt Busch. Truex and Menard. Busher and Dylan. Boyer and Keslowski. The top ten. We're back under green. Boy, that 18, I mean, he shot out through the lead. I was going to say, they just shot some rockets off with NASA. <laughs> and I think somehow Kyle Busch got a hold of those rockets because, my goodness, did he launch off that restart. Austin Dillon stuck in the middle of a three-wide that still is now it finally breaks up. Mike, I talked to Austin Dillon down there a little earlier, and he said, keep an eye on me tonight, DW. This is the best car I've had in Richmond in a long time, so keep an eye on that three car. I didn't think Kevin Harvick was expected to be battling for fourth place right here with Chris Buescher. What an awesome run he's having. Following it up from last week, too. Vince. It's interesting, Chris Buescher says this isn't one of his better tracks. His crew chief, Trent Owen, says, ah, we don't ever typically run well here. Could have fooled us, huh? Oh, boo-hoo. <laughs> they, they really had some momentum last week at uh, Bristol, and they have carried it over this week. Rolled off the hauler, pretty sporty, and they're continuing tonight. They are. Trent Owens, he's a pretty sharp little crew chief, too. He's had some good runs over there with the Petty Bunch at one time or another. Okay, you're fine. Just working inside, inside, inside. Crossover move by Kurt Busch to Clint Boyer. Fighting for sixth. And these guys know one another pretty well, know their driving styles, been racing one another a long time. But remember, they were teammates over there at Stuart Haas for a few years. I, I love it. Made that move. I love it. It's a Chevy against the Ford, a Mustang against the Ford. I, I, I like those rivalries. Paul Menard right with them. And right yellow car. Uh, the Brothers. I saw the Menard but an eighth right now. Doing a nice job so far. I know we're early in the race, 51 laps, but uh, keeping up with the keeping the pace up, that's important. Man. Mike Richmond really suits his style. He's a rhythm driver. You give him a few laps, he gets into a rhythm. He's really showing it. Right now, as you mentioned, currently running in the eighth position. Very little adjustments on that stop. There's a slight air pressure change to kind of help him roll better to the center of the corner. Riding with Ryan Brees, the rookie. Former NASCAR modified champ. Kirk Brother on board camera. And just ahead of him, you're the bug on the bumper of Denny Hamlin's Toyota. Denny had some issues on that pit stop or the restart, but he was ahead of all these guys at the end of those 40 laps, and now he's had to battle with them and get back by them. He's in 25th spot. I think a lot of guys would say, if I follow Hamlin, I'm probably going to have a pretty good night. Right now, though, it's, uh, I've had to rethink that because he's way back in the field. Listen to that. So much off-throttle time here to roll the corner. But you can see the glow of that, that brake rotor on the 43 car, how long it keeps blowing into the corner. You use a lot of brake here to turn one, and you carry it all the way to the center of the corner. Mike, that, that sound the engine makes, that gets in your... You, 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 that's 